Hello students, my name is Professor Mohammad Asim and we are doing ADMATH. ADMATH for IGCSE students which have syllabus code 0606 and for CIEO level students which have syllabus code 4037. So both kind of students can get equal benefit from this course. Students in last lecture we finished question number 8 of exercise 9.4 from chapter number 9. Today we are going to do one more question from this exercise question number 9. Before I start question number 9 I suggest all those students who are watching my lecture first time kindly first go to my playlist there is a folder name is add math watch all previous lecture then you will have good command on this topic. So let's start question number 9. Question number 9, fx is equals to a plus b sin x. fx is equals to a plus b sin x. Sorry, sin cx. The maximum value of f is 13. Maximum F is 13. The minimum value of F is 5. And the period and the period is 60 degree. And the period is 60 degree. Find the value of A. the value of B and the value of C. Now you have three unknowns A, B and C and your equation given in the question is Fx is equals to A plus B sin Cx. So first write this equation Fx in this way B sin Cx plus A. Assign that name of equation is equation number 1 and now compare this equation by the equation which is given in your book a sin bx plus c. So a in equation number 2 the amplitude therefore if you compare both the equation b is amplitude. the maximum value from the axis and b c if you compare both the equation the coefficient of x is b in equation number 2 and the coefficient of x in equation number 1 is c and what is c it is the related to the period related to period and what is a compare both the equation equation number 2 is c and equation number 1 is a so in equation number 1 a is related to y shift so we have to find the amplitude b the uh, value of C which is related to period and the value of A which is Y shift. Very easy. The formula of period of sine is 360 degrees upon C. The period in the question is given 60 degrees. 60 is equal to 360 degrees upon C. 66 the 360 hence the value of c is 6 the first requirement has fulfilled coming about the second requirement now i am going to find the value of a which is y shift 
it is very easy the value of a the y shift is fine the mid point of maximum of f plus minimum of f upon 2 kindly keep in mind the y shift is to find by using the midpoint of maximum and minimum of f the maximum of f is given 13 the minimum of f is given 5 upon 2 13 plus 5 is 18 18 upon 2 is 9 therefore a is 9 now coming about the uh, amplitude how to find amplitude it is very easy amplitude basically the maximum distance from y shift so amplitude b is equals to your y shift is 9 so 9 minus 5 or this is obtaining from the minimum value of the function 9 minus 5 or 13 minus 9 both answer is same so amplitude is 4 hence the requirement has fulfilled the value of a is 9 the value of b which is amplitude is 4 and the value of c which is related to the period is 6 a is 9 b is 4 and c is 6 this is our final answer so in this type of equation the first number which you must find is the value of coefficient of x because from period this constant is easily be find the second is to find the y shift because without y shift you are unable to find the amplitude and after y shift just subtract this y shift from the maximum value or subtract the minimum value from the y shift you will get the same answer so this is question number 9 from your book what next the next question is question number 10 which will we do in next lecture kindly do practice more and more and more then you will have good command on this topic if you like my videos kindly do subscribe my channel and don't don't forget the uh, don't forget to press the bell icon button kindly share my videos as many as you can okay students good luck for next lecture